So you want to know which one is better? Going to college, a four-year institution, or going to barbering school? Are you at a crossroads in your life? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm here to tell you which one was better for me. Let's tap in. Bow. So which one was better for me? Mm. You know, <clears throat> that's an interesting topic. And the reason why I say that is because... I mean, don't get me wrong. I wanted to go to college, a four-year institution to make, to make a difference, to make a difference in someone's life. And I thought going to college was the only way I could do that. So, excuse the head, I me. Mean, ain't got a haircut in a little minute, so <clears throat> it's time. But anyway, um, I went to a four-year institution and I, uh, I got my degree in business marketing. Initially, I went for music education because like I said previously, I wanted to make a difference. And my band director, he's the one that made a difference in my life. So I saw that that was the only way I was going to be able to do that by being a band director. I'd be able to have a little more extra time with each student. I could have them personally. And then I got into my student teaching, realized I did not want to be in a classroom setting with kids all day. Mm -mm, couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Kids got too many personalities. I, uh -uh. Like, let's just say I had 150 kids. I'll fight 150 kids. <clears throat> but anyway, neither here nor there. I'm not there anymore. But I still fight kids. I ain't scared. I ain't scared. I ain't scared. So anyway, um, uh, so I realized I didn't want to be in a classroom setting with kids all day. So changed my major to business marketing. My father, he has, he's been running his own business since I want to say 2006. Don't quote me on that. I hope that's right. But anyway. <clears throat> so business to me was like really second nature and I was already cutting since 2015 so I was like okay well let me just combine these two together so upon doing that um I had like a epiphany moment like I was okay I can really do this. Like, I figured out how I can seriously, seriously make a make a way for myself, make a name for myself in this uh, in this industry. <clears throat> so anyway, um, what happened? Uh, but what I'll say is this: the reason why I say it's neither bad nor good that I went to a four-year institution before wanting to become a barber because um, because going to college essentially it brought me out my shell. If it wasn't for me going to college, I wouldn't be a barber today probably. I don't know. Maybe, no, yeah, I probably would. But that's another video. But anyway, some of the struggles that um, up and coming barbers, they have to face now. I mean, I faced them back in college. Um, so like the fact of building your clientele, um, dealing with different personalities, dealing with different emotions, dealing with uh, different hair textures. I mean... I did that. I started that doing that back in 2015. So the fact that I'm just in a shop setting now is really just second nature for me. But anyway, am I in focus? Yeah, I'm in focus. So anyway, <sighs> um, so yeah, it was very, 
I mean, that's why I say it was neither good nor bad. So fast forward to barbering. Um, they told me the program I was a part of is going to take roughly 10 months to a year and a half. And uh, I was said, so I, ugh, excuse me, I'm stumbling over my words. So I asked them, when can I start? Um, my initial day that I was going to start was, I think they told me it was in December. But they ended up telling me that I, my official start date when I went back up there and talked to them, that I could start like November 17th, somewhere up in there, if I'm not mistaken. So, as you can see, I was gung-ho. So, I was like, let's go. It's, it's time. I'm not here to waste no time. You gave me an opportunity. I'm not going to waste it. So, anyway. um, <clears throat> uh, So, after... So as the time goes on during barber school and everything, I ran into certain instances where, in a sense, I didn't really feel like a student. Like I felt like an unpaid intern. So we're not gonna really get into that. But I mean, I already came in with the skill set and knowledge of, well, let's rephrase it. I came in with the basics of knowing how to cut hair. Now, I didn't know everything that entails for my barbering board. So I will say they got me prepared for that. So I was like, okay, okay, okay. They gave me something there. And I did learn a different skill set, like as far as retwisting locks, starting locks, upkeep of hair, um, different fading techniques, different uh, tricks to make me move faster when cutting. Straight hair. It got me real comfortable with cutting straight hair. I'll say that. Um, and there's a video coming up about uh, me cutting straight hair too. But anyway, so it was uh, it was a good experience and everything like that. But as far as which one was better, honestly, I can't say any outweighed other because if I would have never went through both, I should say. I wouldn't be the man I am today. Being able to stand on my own too. Um, the different leadership roles I was put into in college prepared me for today. Actually standing up, having a voice for myself. Actually being able to move with professionalism, which is very hard and, well, it's not really hard, but which is very mm, unheard of in our industry when people get uh when people get to a certain uh status i should say now of course you're going to be yourself but it, at the same time it should be some level of professionalism so anyway getting off that topic like i say i'll everything i'm speaking on of course i'll make a video of it and everything like that but i mean honestly speaking like i say they 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 both weigh, they both weigh, they both hold heavy, heavy places in my heart. So with that being said, I can't necessarily just say that going to a four-year university, four-year institution was better than going, me going to trade school. Because one, I already wanted to be a barber, but me going to a four-year institution first, that's what brought me out my shell. That's what brought um that's what brought Mike LeBron instead of Michael LeBron. Like uh I'll never forget it. Uh come on, a couple of my friends from Atlanta. They uh they're the ones who really got me um got me gave me that uh gave me that nickname. That's another story. But anyway, yeah. It I'm thankful. I'm thankful for both. I'm appreciative of both. And yeah, if I wanna if anybody asks me would I ever go back and change anything? No, I wouldn't. Cause it be brum brum.
then bye bye. Over and. And like, share, <clears throat> uh, 